Dr. Jeremy Martinez here. If you've been following current affairs and news for the past few months, you should now be aware of the dangerous disease Ebola. We've seen thousands of deaths in West Africa and even YouTube pranksters running around the U.S. in hazmat suits, scaring crowds. But just how deadly is this virus? Stay here for the next few minutes and you will know the top five must known facts about Ebola and how they relate to you. Ebola first appeared in 1976 so it is a disease known to us for decades. As of September 26, 2014 there have been around 7,000 cases of Ebola mainly in West Africa. Ebola is often fatal. The original source of Ebola most likely came from contact with infected animals and is a result of the Ribion nuclei acid virus. Early Ebola symptoms are shared with other viral infections and include fever, headaches, vomiting, and diarrhea. Internal and external bleeding is common in later stages. Of the 7,000 cases, around half of the people have died. This is due to the lack of medical attention mainly. There is no vaccine for Ebola, but with the right treatment, patients can increase their survival rate. However, the race is on to develop new medications. One experimental antibody-based drug, ZM app, is currently under trial. Ebola is not airborne and there is no evidence to show that mosquitoes can carry it. Even with mutations, it is unlikely to go airborne. This is good news as the disease is classified as mildly contagious. Lastly, Ebola is not a risk to the general public in the U.S. There is only risk when you are in direct contact with bodily fluids. So far, there is only one report case in Dallas. Travel warnings have been issued for certain African countries, and the CDC is currently not screening people at airports who have arrived from such nations. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment, and like for more updates on your well being.